It took crews about 20 hours to free the man from a very, you saw that right there, narrow space. ABC 10 News reporter Austin Gravish was there this morning as that rescue finally came to an end, Austin. Good evening. While it is calm here now, but earlier today it looked like something out of a movie here at this popular scenic spot as crews pulled this man to safety. Tonight, a dramatic rescue coming to an end in Ocean Beach. This man being pulled up to safety after being trapped in a cave at Sunset Cliffs. It's a total miracle. I cannot believe what these guys did. The rescue effort started Thursday after the quick thinking of a group of teenagers. I heard like screaming saying help. I've been stuck for three days, help. Tonight, those friends, including Justin Florentino, are being hailed as heroes because they didn't just call 911. One of them was totally covered in mud in a space, and they said they found a guy down there who said he'd been trapped for three days, and they tried to go down into the hole and get him. If they didn't call 911, we wouldn't be having the story that we do today. Can you hold on to me? This video inside the cliff shows just how tight the space was. Over. The man clearly in pain as emergency crews tried to free him. Now, this rescue was a massive operation. I'm told in all there were over 150 people involved and a special team from San Bernardino County was called in. Deputy Fire Chief Dan Eddy told me with rising waters Thursday night, drowning was a major concern. We've never had a technical rescue like this before. Eddie says crews had to use a special micro blasting system to cut into the rocks as the man went in and out of consciousness. He says the hole the man slid into was about 15 feet underground. And gushing water made this rescue a big challenge. Tonight, the 20 hour emergency operation is being called a miracle. This is a total Christmas miracle. I was so grateful to be able to see it. A Christmas miracle, really no other words to describe the effort of the emergency crews here, because one thing is clear, the outcome could have been much, much worse. Reporting live from Ocean Beach, Austin Gravish, ABC 10 News.